All right, uh, hello everyone. This is the first video I'm going to try on the new Canon uh, camera. So, uh, the first kind of unboxing I want to do is for uh, Legacy Inferno. So, we'll just take a little quick look at the packaging. Um, kind of neat. To focus on this head there. Uh, but yeah, just uh, kind of neat little packaging. So, we'll take it. And um, let's get this bad boy open up here. Let's see where the tape is on the bottom. So let's slice that. Man, these new boxes, they're just so flimsy, man. I know they're trying to save cost savings and everything else, but. Um, I mean, man, the cardboard. I mean, look at that box. is just absolutely flimsy as can be. So let's get him uh, slid out. Oh, that is a very nice, very nice figure. Um, we have his instructions in the back. And he comes on some cardboard here. Yeah, very good looking figure. I mean, extremely good looking figure here. Uh, yeah, so this is um, basically, yeah, he looks about the same size as the original. A lot more detail on, the, on the, the new version. I do like the colors, that translucent red on the original. I think better than this guy. It, it looks like it has a more premium finish with the original figure uh, versus the new figure. So, without any um, further ado, let's, let's get this guy cut out of here and I should have brought my uh, my cutting but I didn't so that's all right we will we will free him out of his confines here uh, I like the little weapon um, it's similar to his torso on the original one um, oh he just fell on out of there didn't he all right, so, yep, yeah, he is free. A um, bunch of plastic little bits everywhere from cutting him out. Uh, first look. Yeah, I mean, man, that is a... I like that head sculpt. That is a very good-looking head sculpt there. So, uh, versus the original head sculpt. Still a good head sculpt. Um, but the, the newer one looks really good, too, so... Man, that is just a good looking, good looking figure, um, all the way around. So, abdomen. The robot mode is a lot cleaner. Uh, oh, you can put his little gun back in there too, right? So, yeah, robot mode is a lot cleaner looking um, than the original one. It transforms a lot better because the original one, he's just kind of stuck with his abdomen, with his little. Uh, deal here you know he has his gun and everything but it's kind of it's more of a uh it's more of a of a gimmick because it makes um all of this spin so when you when you press his gun it just kind of spins everything around right so um it's neat the original figure is pretty sweet uh, let me spin this thing here so i can kind of uh fold it up again but it doesn't detach and you can't not to my knowledge, anyway. Uh, I don't think he can use it in his hand. Whereas this gun is kind of like an homage. This gun is kind of like an homage to the original uh, torso. Um, but yeah, it's a really, really, really good looking figure, man. I am super impressed by the, by the quality of it. Um, yeah, anyway, this is just a quick little basic... Uh, unboxing video I don't want to get too much into uh, more than that let's look at the instructions real quick it says 49 no it doesn't say 49 steps it has 26 steps to transform it into uh, beast mode and yeah it's a lot man oh you can you can mount it in the back also it, it'll peg in to kind of give it the original um, look here you can peg it into the torso so it looks like the original one but 
He looks to be about a head taller than the uh, original figure. And the jo I need to tighten up the joints on this this guy. His joints are very, very loose. And, uh, I know the weight is offset because of the abdomen and stuff, but yeah, no, just good looking figures, man. Both of these are some really, really good looking uh, Transformers. I do like the translucent plastic. I mean, this one looks good in its own right. Um, I just, I like the head sculpt better on the new one. Like I said, that head sculpt is just awesome. I don't know why I put my hand, I don't need to do it. The autofocus on the, the new camera works really well. It'll automatically like blur out the background. They have this shooting mode on here where it'll focus on like whatever's in front near the camera and then automatically it'll focus back on its own. So it's pretty sweet. But yeah, this just, I want to do a quick little, little video. Um, yeah.